Hi everyone, my name is W Alex, and today we're continuing God of War. And we've just become Odin's apprentice. We've helped him out and maybe gained his trust. So now let's go to bed and see what's gonna happen on the next day. Yeah, and he also gave us this mask we need to complete for him. That was an interesting transition. What the? Hmm. Does he not have his knife with him now? Oh, is that one? Okay, that's... No news, I'm afraid. I have a plan. Do you know? What's he gonna do? Bust into the Asgard. The Lords. You found them once. Could you do so again? I could try, but I don't see how that they would help. They are the fates of these lads, are they not? I would know what they know. You may not find them cooperative. As long as I find them, where do we search? Midgard. But if Atreus is in Asgard, there's no getting him back without an army. We should be raising one. Yes, nothing like a catastrophic war to improve the situation. The boy seems quite capable, perhaps if you simply give him some time. You are not free of blame here. You encouraged his foolishness, his confusion. I do not seek war. But if Odin has stolen my son, do not doubt the lengths I will go to. Mm -hmm. Your nature has always been clear, Kratos. But you, Freya. War is a first resort. That's not the Freya I knew. She's changed. I hope the Norns can give you the counsel you need. Perhaps mine is no longer of use here. Tear, stop. This is no time to divide ourselves further. Come, sit, please. You have been quiet. Frankly, I'm surprised you of all people would seek out fate. But your instincts haven't let us down so far. Let's find the norms. Guess he wants to know what Atreus actually knows. I want to know what his fate is. What the fate he has seen. That's why Odin imprisoned you in the first place. He's terrified of you. I doubt that very much. It's the truth. And not just because of prophecies. No one has ever united the realms as you once did. That is not who I am anymore. I know you feel that way now. I've lost myself before, more than once, but believe me, there is something beyond that. And what is that? Purpose. Purpose is the path that leads you to yourself. So you would have me accept my fate. Lead your armies into war, secure your vengeance. If securing our justice is not your purpose, then find another for your own sake.
Yeah, I can't really be sitting there on one doing much. Does it hurt? Oh, this? Only when I worry. How would a trace get to Asgard? I'm sorry, but you'd have to ask Odin. He's got control of every path. I know how highly you esteem our expertise on such things, so I'm sure that's disappointing. He's just been one step ahead of us. Only well, sounds alone. Most of that realm, I guess. Oh, yeah, that's the new armor we can get from the dwarf. Hang on! I got something for you. Sindri! Coming! Before you go traipsing off into the dawn, I thought you oh. might have Don't go getting too cheery about it. But you're welcome. I've collected what we need to find the Norns. You could at least say Shall thank you. Neathope. I suspect we may have consequences to look forward to. Is he gonna mention? Oh, there he is. Squirrel. Ah, Master Kratos, my apologies. Madam Neethode's disappearance weighs heavily on my mind. She a friend of yours? Less a friend than another long-time tenant of the tree. She was here even before I arrived, and that was ages ago. To even think something could keep her away from her babies. Uh -huh. terrible, just terrible. Uh, you wanna tell him? Cause I kinda don't. No? Okay. Well, I got that Oscar. You see, um, we kinda had to kill Nidhogg. That was self defense, so I guess it's fine. Uh. could not still be in Midgard. I was just there and found no trace. If Odin invited him, he must have provided a way. No, that is not the only explanation. Mm. Tell me where we find these norms. I discovered some of their threads near the frozen lake. I stashed one for spellcrafting, but we may also use it to find them. Just remember, they really don't want to be found. Well, at least things will be difficult for a change. We should take your sled and head to the lake. Midgard, how I've missed the freezing gusts and constant raider attacks. Oh, that's because they believe Kratos is responsible for Fimble Winter and that killing him will end it. Where would they get an idea like that? From me, of course. Of course. <laughs> yep, of course. Come. Good dogs. Quiet. She is a friend. Now. Better they get this from you. Once the wolves have the scent of the Norns, we'll just need to follow their lead. Mm. I will open the gate. <laughs> Stop whining. Their fur is matted. When did you last brush them? They are wolves. And matted fur leads to disease. Take care of them and they'll take care of you. Um, I guess Aethras would do Brother, those what exactly things. do you intend to ask the Norns? How I may find my son, but nothing more. You don't imagine it's a chance to clear up all this mess about prophecy? Perhaps get a second opinion on your alleged demise. You didn't tell me you had a death prophecy? 
when Atreus and I reached Jotunheim, we found a hidden mural. The giants, Fay herself, had foreseen our entire journey long ago. Who we would meet, whom we would fight. All of it, as it happened. But you aren't dead. That image was from a time yet to come. I see. You've never struck me as someone who fears death. That's not the problem, is it? No. Death can have me when it burns me. Then maybe it's not the future that bothers you. Faye sent you on your journey, and she made sure you'd see that image at the end of it. And you're still not sure why. I wish to speak of this no further. Now that we are on the lake, how will we find the Norns? Watch the wolves closely. See how their heads point the way? Well, the Lake of Nine has certainly seen better days. The raiders have made themselves quite at home. Not sure I've been back to these parts since our great battle with Seekrin. She speaks highly of that fight as well. You know of that. She told me all about it when she found me. She believed you could be an ally. Long before I believed it. The Valkyrie Queen. An ally. I'm the Valkyrie Queen. As Sigrun was stubbornly determined to remind me. I should have guessed it was Sigrun helping you recover yourself. She's so loyal. Wise. Clever. Oh. Mm-hmm. Doesn't take a love goddess to see where you're coming from. This thread of fate we are tracing. It's not somebody's life, if that's what you mean. The Norns use it to mark their way when they're outside of the well. The Norns live in a well. No. The well of Earth, their home, is... hard to explain. Brother, seems the wolves have led us here. <laughs> Hope the norns are somewhere indoors. I'm warm. Safe to say, no, I have not missed Midgard and Thimblewinter. Thank you. <laughs> we will see. Isn't that what you said? Enough. Only off that you missed. Watch the fire. Oh, that's the skill I use. There we go. Impressive. Back here. 
the ominous broken gravestone. The hilt of a sword. Brother, I know that sword hilt. <laughs> Tread carefully. You of all people know how weapons can carry ghosts. Oh, yeah. If it does not help us find the Norns, it can wait. I feel a trace of their illusions here. I can try to dispel it. Oh, no. There's nothing here. A false trail. I'm afraid so. We'll have to see what else the wolves can find. Typical Nornish mischief. They know we're searching. I warned you they wouldn't make it easy. And what's the help of a cursed king have to do with any of it? Distraction? Coincidence? Who knows? I suppose they'd say we were fated to find it. As I was saying, the Norn's home is called the Well of Earth. It's in no fixed place. Entrances come and go. Hold that thought. I think it's about to get violent. Huh. Get on fire, Kratos. It will burn. Go again. How did you miss all of those? Left side, brother. Just like one third of my health immediately. Ah! 
see what is going on. He makes himself explode on contact. Me of tales of a cruel empress, one too angry to die. We will see. Yeah, fucking damn, but that was harder than it probably should be. There's also no healing in this place. Well, we got a chaos block out of it, so. Earth, I guess. Yeah. That's one of those. That's all. Yeah. I was telling you about the Well of Erd, where the Norns dwell. A place wholly under their influence, where the intangible becomes tangible. Like being inside your own mind. But if we go in together, are we in each other's mind? Not so sure I like the sound of that. Mimir, have you encountered these Norns? Not personally. <coughs> Bear's right. They have ways of discouraging visitation. Odin made his share of efforts. Wouldn't talk about what he found. Either he gave up, or he wanted to forget what he saw. Bear, do you mind telling us what you experienced when you sought the Norns last time? To be honest, the details are hazy. Like waking up from a dream. Mainly, I remember that nothing could be done to change my son's fate. Which only made me more determined to try. Let's see. I feel something. In this direction. Feel what exactly? Okay. illusion. That wall. It's coming from this wall. The Norns are hiding something. Well, of course they are. Oh, no. They're hiding themselves, too. Another, A trap. Another dead end. Use your shield! Behind you! Look at him! 
Oh shit, more. You know, this search will only get more dangerous. Then we keep looking. Back to the wolves, then. Let's see what's up here. What is up here? I don't feel anything. It's not related to the Norns. Could be interesting enough in its own right. What's that outpost? Good thing we didn't miss this. Listen, Liam. You're doing good. Oh, I only got a spark, not a lame. I am, as always, at your service. You won't believe it, Mimi. This crest belongs to Fjotorlund. Fjotorlund, you say? Now that's where Seekran was from. Hmm. Side quest about Seekran. Well, we got the main story to do. Oh, wonderful. Could have used that in the fight. their heads brother what of your story you face the fates of your homeland yeah the legends i heard about the ghost of sparta were surely exaggerated exaggerated oh not in the brazen bloodshed righteous fury part the part where it said you traveled back in time itself to win a battle once lost it strains credulity obviously I mean, a rumor about Thor ah. knocking the world serpent back in history from Ragnarok is one thing. It is the truth. The threads of fate span all life and time. The sisters of fate abused their power. When I challenged them, they threatened to undo my existence. So I killed them and turned their power on Zeus. That's the most dangerous and irresponsible thing I've ever heard. These Norns have no such magic, nor does anyone in these realms that I've ever seen. Aye, can you imagine? If it existed, Odin would have it. And if Odin had it, we'd be five shades more fucked than we are already. I would not ask them to change the past, even if they could. I only want information. And that's quite dangerous enough, in my experience. Well, especially if it's Odin we're talking about. We need to... Ah! <laughs> 
Yeah, so where's the last one? making magical ice walls now no i think the water just froze <laughs> Friends. I didn't tell them to be here. Above your fire! <laughs> What the Norns did to trick all these raiders into guarding them. Not that they have any idea that's what they're doing. They are weak. Freya, thank you for your help. I know this was not your focus. The sooner we find your son, the sooner you'll be able to focus. I just hope it works. Just the same. Thank you. A fine sentiment, but right on a bloody note when we're out of the cold, brother. <sighs> brother, this way seems like a way out, not a way in. I concur. The Norns are further up. <sighs> but there's a chest half. Oh, that sounds pretty useful, actually. Oh. 
Oh, that would be enough to stun him. Found it. Ah, isn't it always the third place you look? Two. Third time's the charm. Is everyone hearing that creepy whisper? It is like an itch in the mind. It means we've stepped into their domain. Be ready for anything. Illusions. Projections, possibly. But assume nothing. There's no telling what manner of creature they've made on Wooden Guard. Delightful. Ah, that's probably not worth it, huh? With his own soul too. Oh, get them. Are we in our own minds yet? He certainly seems real enough. I hate to tell you, the parts in your mind will be real too. <laughs> I could probably upgrade my shield again. We get enough coins. Hostile memory at that. These fates should know I will not be deterred. Brother, I had a thought. What if we took a stealthy approach to our next battle? <laughs> no. <laughs> no fucking way, Kratos can do stealth. Oh, she would hope to protect. <laughs> she always finds 
What's this then? Oh, wait, what? They uh, attack the third uh, thing. Nice one, Freya. Need my coins. Well, certainly clinks like genuine hack silver. I suppose there's one small consolation to this ordeal. At least we won't have to introduce ourselves. Don't credit your reputation, Mamir. They see the whole lives of any who approach them. What is that? Oh! 
That wasn't too bad. Another gift of Fimblewinter, I suppose. The magic draining out of all of us has to end up somewhere. Ooh. Now we got a Chaos Flame. This way. The Norns are somewhere in that cave just ahead. So I need to fight again. Pretty soon. Seeing as the game gave me full health. There's that itchy sound again. Normally I don't mind ladies whispering in my ear. But this is positively awesome. <laughs> Anyone ever tell you that you babble when you're terrified? Terrified? I'll have you know I'm at the very most deeply apprehensive. And breaking tension with humor is the sacred duty of a traveling companion. <laughs> hey, how very dare you! Babbling! <laughs> well, yeah, he got that part of mine. The comedy. And how's the arena? We gotta fight him. Oh, or. that looks official. My boy. Balder, listen to me. So I need to fire it, Balder. Stop! Why did you bring him here? You are not welcome here. Wait! Balder, come back! Talk to me. What you did to me. What you did to me. What the? Oh, fine. Over here, 
Come get me. I want none of this. Mimir! Secret? Brother, hold off. Why did you never turn on Odin? But I did. I tried to stop him any way I could. Don't lie! You served Odin from the day you met him to the day he put you in that tree. You sought our favor. You clawed his heart. You watched him destroy everyone and everything. And you never gave a damn until you turned on you. I know, Sigrun. It's true. All of it. But for love of you, I became a better man, a counselor, an ally. Oh. Were you an ally to Freya in his suffering? To God? To Troa? Or to Talia? No! no. You are to the side of the powerful thing! You! Brother, watch out! There's more of them! Even now, you see a violent god in need, and you can't help but aid him and call him brother! It's who you are! It is not her. No. Of course. You did what you must. Brother, the tree! It's pulling me in! Mamir! Brother, help me! No, it's Kaylos' okay. storm. I am coming! No. Why didn't you trust your own son? Don't let him take me! Atreus! I'm scared! Why wouldn't you see him the way he wants to be seen? No! I don't want to go I am here! So I can pass on this thing too. Wow. Oh, I need to continue. the test didn't feel much like succeeding i see the door has disappeared or it was never there they toy with us still what is that a kelpie don't see many of those in these parts she must be theirs will she take us to them i'll ask her nicely easy girl easy that's right Have to talk about whatever the norms put you through? No. Get on. That's a good lass. Lovely creatures, but temperamental by reputation. In my land, they'd keep children away from the lost by telling them a Kelpie would drown them. Of course, no Kelpie I know would do such a thing. Unless it was disrespected. It walks on water. Aye. No mystical water steeds to speak of in Greece, brother? Mm. There were the hippocamps. They served the sea god. I battled one upon a titan. <laughs> that might not be her favorite subject. Thank you for the ride. Here. Fate's own hideaway. Never doubt it would make it. No, you could say it was fate that brought her here.
Kratos, Freya, and Mimir's head. Enter the home of the Norns, tentatively. They have finally reached their destination. Kratos speaks first. I, I seek, seek my, my son! son. <laughs> You know the child is an Asgard. Yep. No, you seek what all who search for us seek. To know the ending to your story. The ghost of Sparta furrows his brow menacingly. He resists the urge to grunt. No, oh, he fails. You come to us, piteous archetypes, seeking freedom from your scripts, as if knowing your lines would grant you the power to rewrite them. Speak, Speak plain. plain. <laughs> you will die, Kratos of Sparta. But you, but you called him the destroyer, destroyer of fate. fate. There, there must, must be a way, way to, to subvert, subvert destiny. destiny. There is no destiny, Park. Protagonists are speechless. They do not understand. There is no grand design, no script. Only the choices you make. That your choices are so predictable, merely make us seem prescient. When my son was born, oh, shut up! <laughs> God, she's annoying. Your prophecy said he would die a needless death, and he did. Because you could not let him go. Because he thirsted for revenge. And because you kill gods. <laughs> but what Kratos did, it was not out of hate. Should I bring him a crown then? Ah, yes, please. Still slays gods, but now he's sad about it? You are the sum of your choices, nothing more. And because your choices never change, you will learn that Heimdall intends to kill your son in Asgard, and you will do what you do best. And then Ragnarok. The skies burn, the curtains fall. Exunt omni. Heimdall. <laughs> Again, he misses the point. <laughs> Focusing on the second act, to the exclusion of the final. A common mistake in storycraft. We are yeah, leaving. leaving. Can I kill one of them <laughs> and I leave? He stomps away, followed closely by Freya. I enjoyed your story, Kratos. Pity it has to end so soon. <laughs> <laughs> Well, that was educational. <laughs> Let us leave this place. Happily. Things getting more normal already. Wait, that tree. Well, isn't that interesting? What is this? That's the noose brother, the one Odin hanged himself with, as part of his endless mad quest for secrets of life and death and what have you. What are you doing? It's a charged object, significant to Odin. Perhaps I'll find a use for it. Ah, uh, sounds like it could be of use. Brother, what they said about the boy... ...will not happen. Oh, I agree. It will not happen. We will not let it. Of course we bloody won't. The question is how? You wouldn't mm. seriously consider killing Heimdall, would you? I will do what I must. Oh, is that all? You're wrong to dissuade him, Mimir. You know Heimdall. I grant you that he's a spiteful, vicious little shit. And so loyal, Odin entrusted him with Galahorn. 
If we have the chance to eliminate him before Ragnarok, we shouldn't hesitate. Considering his powers of foresight alone, that is an if of mountainous size. <laughs> yeah, he sounds like a bitch. And he's also a bitch to deal with, I guess. Even supposing we're all perfectly comfortable plotting an assassination, and I, for one, am a mite rusty at that measure, we've got no way to reach Heimdall, and no way to kill him if we did. I have killed gods greater than him. I don't Très... doubt that, brother, but it's hardly my point. I see something. That's a flame. Up there. But I guess she was talking about her way upwards. Look, I think we're missing the Norn's message here. We've all got our tendencies. And yours is to run headlong into danger to protect the ones you love. I do not intend to change. Not about that. Why should you? Apparently my tendency is to kill the ones I love. Freya. I don't need you to comfort me. Either of you. Their accusation was cruel. None of us believe... The truth can be a cruel thing. Anyone care to argue with that? No. But Baldur's fate had many causes. Prophecy among them. How do you mean, brother? There are many tales in my homeland of those who fulfilled prophecy by attempting to avoid it. So it was when Freya tried to protect Balder, and so it was when I accused my son of going to Asgard. Then we agree. It'd be foolish to go after Heimdall. No. <laughs> if Heimdall must die for Atreus to live, then Heimdall must die. How can you say that, knowing what you know? Because if Heimdall is a threat to my son, I must act. It is my Your nature. Well played, Norns. <laughs> Let us find a gateway. Return home. Consider our plans. Listen, brother. Before you make any hasty decisions, why don't you blow off a little steam? I'm sure there was some loose end we meant to circle back to. Give your mind a little time to process everything. I suspect there's unfinished business here at the lake, though I'm certainly happy to spend time somewhere other than Midgard. It's your choice, brother. Hmm. I'm here for you. That's good, my mir. Always a joy to work on these. Well, I think that's gonna leave it this one, because it's a bit long than these ones will normally be. Thank you guys for watching, and I will hopefully see you in the next one. Bye!